was a pretty good relief and, and it gave you some hope that maybe something will get done. Congressman Pete Session hosted a veteran health care town hall in Brazos County today. And as KRHD news reporter Hannah King shares, the goal is to improve the experiences of veterans and the VA health care system. This is why we're here today. I want you to know I do care. Veterans from four counties across the Brazos Valley voiced their concerns during a veteran health care town hall. I've been in that situation where the tunnel seems that there's no light and I wanted to kill myself. And, you know, by the grace of God, I'm still here. But I, I just want to be a voice to other veterans who may not see that there is a light at the end of the tunnel. Melissa Hosey was just one of many who took the podium by storm Saturday, sharing health care related struggles many veterans face. 20 veterans every single day that are killing themselves. And I, I don't think people really understand how big of a pandemic that is. We owe you a chance to listen to you and do the best. And I told you that I would stick with you. The event was hosted by Congressman Pete Sessions. Six months into leading District 17, Sessions is making veterans and their concerns a priority. I believe it's my job as, as the congressman to set the stage and make sure that we're setting expectations and we're going to meet them. Among the veterans voicing their concerns was Denny Palaszczuk. What are y'all going to do to protect me? Who was pleased to see local leaders putting their boots to the ground. So I've been in the active in the VA system since 2009 when I got out of the Army. And uh, I just didn't, I know I don't like to feel alone and I didn't want any of my fellow brothers and sisters to feel alone in here. Congressman Sessions says this was their second similar town hall meeting. The COVID-19 pandemic delayed these events, but he had a similar one in Limestone County a few weeks ago. The men and women who've given their service to this country want, need, and deserve my attention, and they've got it. Reporting in Bryant, Henny King, KRHD News.